One of the best things you can do with ServiceMate is connect it to a cloud accounting package. ServiceMate supports integrations with leading accounting packages, being Xero and QuickBooks Online worldwide, and MYOB Essentials and AccountRight in Australia and New Zealand. Connected together, ServiceMate and your accounting package form an end-to-end -end best practice pipeline of communication, job management, and accounting. Job and client details are entered once in ServiceMate, where the front-end job management is taken care of. When the job is complete and paid, you can then raise the invoice in your accounting package for easy reconciliation. It's a connection which streamlines your workflow, eliminates double entry, and avoids mistakes. Connecting ServiceMate to your accounting package is a straightforward process. In the desktop app, go to ServiceMate add-ons and find your accounting package. Then click Connect. There may be some steps to confirm details like how tax is dealt with. You'll authorize the connection to ServiceMate and with that, you're done. Once connected, clients, items and tax settings in your accounting package will be imported to ServiceMate for use when you're creating jobs and adding billable items. From this point on, changes made to a synced client or item in either system will automatically update the other. When it comes to new clients and items you create in ServiceMate, these will only be sent to your accounting package if they're contained in an invoice and will remain synced from that point on. Invoices are raised in your accounting package immediately after they're approved in ServiceMate. You can also approve invoices from the invoicing menu of the ServiceMate app. For example, under awaiting approval, we have this job. We can see here an invoice has been sent to the client and here how long it's been since the job was completed. When you tap it, you can see here if it's been paid. This job's invoice is sent and paid, so all that's left to do is raise it in our accounting package for reconciliation. So we'll tap Approve. Keep in mind you can use this act of approving the invoice as a checkpoint for other processes in your invoicing workflow, such as reviewing the billable items on the invoice, sending the invoice, or checking for payment. Over in our accounting package, we can see a new invoice has been raised with the same job number and the client name. With this connection, you've got a single job number from start to finish, the job details and billable items you entered in ServiceMate have come across, and staff have invoiced the job from the same system it was managed in from day one. Let's look at another scenario where the invoice hasn't been paid yet. If it suits, you can still approve an unpaid invoice from ServiceMate to your accounting package. Once you record a payment in ServiceMate, the paid status will then sync and update the invoice in your accounting package, with the exception of MYOB. Alternatively, you can approve an unpaid invoice, then record its payment in your accounting package, with the payment status syncing back and updating ServiceMate. Check out the Help Centre for the specifics of how the connection works for your accounting package. Now you understand how the invoice approval process works, take a look at this. With invoicing access, you can set the ServiceMate app to automatically approve invoices on checkout meaning you can finalize an invoice, take payment, send the invoice to the client and raise it in your accounting software on site before heading to the next job.